Could you use the skills of a mercenary? I lost another three patients this morning. The families. They got caught between a group of Athenians and Spartans. This war needs to end. I'm sure there will be peace. Soon. There will be no end unless someone does something about it. Look! There must be some way to at least get them away from here. Take their food. Weapons, boats even. I'll pay you. So, I have to sink the Athenian fleet. I knew I asked the right person. All right, I'm in. My thanks, Mystios. I should get going. Okay. You there. You have a kind soul. Help an old man buy his next meal. Your soul also seems kind. I am grateful and humbled, stranger. Tell me, what do they call you? I'm Cassandra. And you? Just a simple beggar. I sailed from Persia to see the beauty of the Greek world. I can do many things, Persian, but I can't restore sight. Nor would I want you to. My blindness is a burden that the gods have given me to carry, and I will. Then what? Be my eyes. When I was a boy, an Athenian told me the most beautiful tales of your lands. I would love to hear them again. Would you go see the places I never was able to, and return to tell me the tale of your adventures? I'm not much of a storyteller, but I will be your eyes. I knew I sensed kindness in you. You made this old Persian happy again. Don't thank me yet. What places do you wish you could have seen? Ah, my favorite tales were always of the Acropolis. The statues of Zeus in Athena, the perch of the armored bird in Arcadia, and of course, the mysterious mount Taigetos. What do you know about the statue of Zeus? Its great bowl stood ready to punish the Kefalonians below. Or so I was told. I've seen Kefalonia from the statue of Zeus. Tell me, is it still a place of great beauty? Yes, the island is beautiful. From the statue of Zeus, you can see the sea hitting the white beaches and the mountains covered in green. But the people suffer because of the war. Ah, just how it was described to me. The gods simultaneously bless the land and curse the people. Even for gods, your gods are cruel, Miss Theos. Okay, I've told you what I remember. Now tell me about yourself. What's a Persian doing here? Persia and the Greek world are doomed to be opposites. In times of prosperity here, Persians always seem to suffer. And when you are at war with yourselves... Persians know peace? Indeed. My people prospered after King Xerxes was murdered. All except for me. A man tried to kill me with poison, which is how I lost my sight. I fled and arrived here. I find it hard to believe anyone would want you dead. You're very kind. Tell me another tale, then I'll tell you more of my past. 
There are many statues to Athena. Which one do you mean? In my mind, there is only one. Her story always began. As we rounded the hilltops, we could see Athens bustling below us and Athena above, matching our gaze. The Acrocorinth? Don't tell me. It's in Corinthia. Smart guess. It is the most renowned temple to Aphrodite, your goddess of all life's most pleasurable trivialities. You did say Mount Cayetos, didn't you? You sound like you know that place. I have heard tales of its appetites. They say the mountain feeds on the suffering of Spartans, so the people there offer their own children to the mountain god for sacrifice. That's... that's not exactly right. What do you remember about this armored bird in Arcadia? There's a beast made of armor jutting out from the mountainside overlooking Lake Stymphalos and the undulating fields stretching like waves on a golden sea all across Arcadia. I'll be back with stories to tell. As soon as you've seen one location, please return. This papyrus is so old. Could this be writing by Themistocles? Let me know what you need. Come back anytime.
Athenian leader is dead. I should return to Stentor. 